Welcome to a journey across the cosmos, a voyage into the unknown. Ever wondered about the mysteries etched in the celestial bodies of our solar system? These aren't just random patterns, but narratives of cosmic events that have shaped the planets and moons we know today. From the fiery collisions of asteroids to the impact of comets, each scar on these celestial bodies tells a unique tale of force, fire and formation. In this video, we're going to unravel the secrets of the top 10 most enigmatic craters etched in the fabric of our solar system. So buckle up and prepare for a journey like no other. You don't want to miss this. What secrets does the solar system hold etched in the scars of its celestial bodies? These scars or craters are more than just marks of impact. They're records of cosmic events, remnants of the solar system's turbulent past. Formed by the fiery collisions of asteroids and comets, each crater tells a unique story of force, fire, and formation. As we traverse the cosmos, these craters provide invaluable insights into the history of our solar system. Join us as we embark on a journey across the solar system, unraveling the mysteries of the top 10 most enigmatic craters. Starting our countdown at number 10, we encounter the Huygens Crater on Mars. Named after the Dutch astronomer Christian Huygens, who was the first to describe Mars with a telescope, this crater is a sight to behold. Stretching a remarkable 465 kilometers in diameter, it's one of the largest impact craters in the solar system. What makes Huygens truly fascinating, though, are the mysteries it holds. It was discovered in the late 19th century, but even after all these years, it continues to pose questions that pique our curiosity. For instance, the peculiar patterns on its floor have left scientists scratching their heads. These patterns, unlike anything we've seen before, hint at geological processes that we're yet to fully understand. Adding to the intrigue is the presence of chaos terrain around the crater. This jumbled, broken landscape suggests a violent past, possibly involving vast amounts of water, but the exact details remain a mystery. Was there once a lake within Huygens? Did water flow across its floor, sculpting the intricate patterns we see today? These unanswered questions make Huygens more than just a crater. It's a testament to the dynamic nature of Mars and a reminder of the many secrets that our neighboring planet still holds. With its intriguing features, Huygens sets a fascinating start to our countdown. Next on our list at number nine, we journey to the sun-scorched planet Mercury to explore the Caloris Crater. The Caloris Basin, as it is sometimes known, is not just another hole in the ground. This colossal impact crater spans a whopping diameter of roughly 1,550 miles. That's about four times the width of Texas. Discovered in 1974 by Mariner 10, the Caloris Crater is one of the largest and most enigmatic craters in our solar system. It's so big, in fact, that it has created a hilly, jumbled terrain on the opposite side of the planet known as the Weird Terrain. Imagine the force of the impact that could cause such a planetary scale effect. What sets the Caloris Crater apart is not just its size, but the mysteries it holds. It boasts a series of intriguing features, including the Pantheon Fossae, a complex of radiating troughs that have baffled scientists for years. And let's not forget the spider-like formation at the center, which remains a subject of ongoing research. But perhaps the most fascinating aspect of the Caloris Crater is the evidence it presents of Mercury's violent past. This colossal scar on the planet's surface is a stark reminder of the celestial impacts that have occurred over billions of years. The Caloris Crater, a testament to the impactful events that have shaped our solar system. Moving along to number eight, we find ourselves staring at the Stickney Crater on Mars moon Phobos. A sight to behold, Stickney is not your average crater. This gaping hole, nearly half the diameter of Phobos itself, stretches an impressive nine kilometers across. That's more than five and a half miles wide for those more familiar with miles. It was first spotted in the late 19th century by American astronomer Asaph Hall, who named it after his wife, Angeline Stickney. Mrs. Stickney had encouraged her husband to persist in his observations of Mars and its moons, leading to this remarkable discovery. Despite its long history of observation, Stickney remains shrouded in mystery. The force required to create such a massive crater without shattering the tiny moon is a puzzle that continues to baffle scientists. Some propose that Phobos's internal structure absorbed the impact, while others suggest the moon was in a molten state when the crater was formed. Adding to the enigma are the strange grooves that radiate from Stickney across the moon's surface. 
Are they related to the impact that created Stickney or do they have a different origin? Many theories have been proposed, but none have been proven conclusively. Stickney, a silent witness to the violent past of the Red Planet's moon, continues to intrigue us. Its secrets are locked within its depths, waiting to be unveiled by future explorations. Will we ever solve the mystery that is Stickney? Only time will tell. Stickney, a silent witness to the violent past of the Red Planet's moon. At number seven, we return close to home to our very own moon and the Tycho Crater. Named after the Danish astronomer Tycho Brahe, this crater is one of the most prominent features on the lunar surface. With a diameter of over 50 miles and an estimated age of about 108 million years, it's a relatively young feature in lunar terms. What sets Tycho apart is its impressive ray system, extending as far as 1,500 kilometers from the crater's center. These rays are composed of ejected material from the impact, streaking across the moon's surface like a celestial spider's web. And at the heart of it all, a towering central peak, rising over a mile above the crater floor, formed from the rebound of the lunar surface following the impact. But Tycho is not just a pretty face, it's also a source of mystery. In the 1960s, the Surveyor spacecraft detected an enigmatic glow at the crater's central peak, a phenomenon now known as transient lunar phenomena. These sporadic, short-lived changes in the lunar surface's appearance are still not fully understood, adding to the enigma that is Tycho. And then there's the Tycho Magnetic Anomaly, an area of strong magnetic fields detected near the crater. What causes these fields? We're still not sure. Tycho, a beacon in the lunar night, continues to puzzle scientists. At number six, we venture to Saturn's moon, Mimas, home to the Herschel crater. This icy moon bears the scars of a past encounter with a massive space object, resulting in the formation of this colossal crater. Named after William Herschel, the astronomer who discovered Mimas in the late 18th century, the Herschel crater stretches across nearly one third of the moon's diameter, making it one of the largest proportional craters in the solar system. It's a stark marvel etched into the icy surface of Mimas with a depth of about six miles and a towering central peak. The discovery of Herschel Crater brought with it intriguing mysteries. One of the most notable conundrums is the survival of Mimas itself. Given the size of the impact that created Herschel, scientists are baffled as to how Mimas didn't shatter into pieces. This unexpected resilience has sparked numerous theories some suggesting a different internal structure or perhaps an impact at just the right angle and speed. Herschel's unique features, such as its shock-altered ice and the fractures radiating from the impact site, also raise questions about the Moon's history and the nature of the impacting object. These mysteries continue to fuel our exploration and understanding of the solar system. Herschel, a stark reminder of the cataclysmic events that have shaped our solar system, Halfway through our countdown, at number five, we find the Rhea Silvia crater on the asteroid Vesta. This colossal impact site, named after the Vestal Virgin, who was the mother of Rome's founder, Romulus, isn't your everyday crater. It's so deep and wide that it takes up nearly 90% of Vesta's diameter. Rhea Silvia was discovered relatively recently in the grand scheme of things, first spotted by NASA's Dawn spacecraft in 2011. The spacecraft's detailed images revealed a crater about 300 miles in diameter with a central peak towering over 13 miles high. To put that into perspective, that's more than twice the height of Mount Everest, the tallest peak on Earth. What sets Rhea Silvia apart, however, are its anomalies. One of the most perplexing is the pattern of troughs that encircle Vesta. These troughs, some of which are wider than the Grand Canyon, suggest a violent impact that almost shattered the asteroid. Yet Vesta survived, leaving scientists to puzzle over how. Another baffling feature is the mound at the crater's center. It's one of the highest mountains in the solar system, and yet it's on a tiny asteroid. Scientists theorize that the mound could be the remains of the impacting body, but the truth remains elusive. Rhea Silvia, a relic of the early solar system, continues to baffle scientists. Its mysteries serve as a reminder of how much we have yet to learn about the cosmic neighborhood we call home. At number four, we journey to Jupiter's moon, Callisto, and the enigmatic Valhalla crater. This colossal impact scar is unlike any other in our solar system. With a central region spanning over 600 miles in diameter, 
Valhalla is surrounded by concentric rings that extend outward for up to a staggering 1,800 miles. This makes it one of the largest multi-ring structures we've ever discovered. It was in the late 70s when the Voyager spacecraft first captured images of this extraordinary crater. But even after decades of scientific advancement, Valhalla continues to baffle us. Part of its mystery lies in its unique structure, suggesting an impact event of a magnitude that far surpasses anything we've seen elsewhere. A closer look at Valhalla reveals a chaotic terrain, a testament to the catastrophic event that once took place here. However, the precise nature of this event remains unknown. What was the size of the impactor? How did the crater's unique multi-ring structure form? And most intriguingly, could this event have influenced the potential for life on Callisto? These questions hover around Valhalla like a shroud, adding layers to its mystery. As we continue to explore the vastness of our solar system, we are reminded of the power and unpredictability of the celestial bodies that inhabit it. Valhalla, a testament to the tumultuous past of the Jovian moons. Number three on our list takes us back to our moon, to the South Pole Aitken Basin. This gigantic impact crater, one of the largest in the entire solar system, stretches across a quarter of the moon's surface, but size isn't the only thing that makes it unique. The basin is also one of the oldest lunar features, with scientists estimating its age to be around four billion years old. The South Pole Aitken Basin was discovered in the late 20th century thanks to the advances in lunar exploration. However, despite decades of studies, it continues to puzzle scientists. For one, its depth is extraordinary. It plunges about eight miles deep, reaching parts of the moon's mantle, a layer usually hidden beneath the crust. But the real enigma lies in the basin's composition. The South Pole Aitken Basin is rich in iron and titanium, elements typically found in the lower crust or upper mantle. Yet the concentrations here are unusually high, even by lunar standards. Scientists have proposed theories, yet none fully explain this anomaly. Some suggest an enormous impactor, possibly an asteroid, struck the moon with such force that it dug deep into the mantle. Others argue that the basin might have been a hotspot of volcanic activity. But as of now, the South Pole Aitken Basin remains an enigma, a lunar puzzle that continues to tantalize scientists and space enthusiasts alike. South Pole Aitken, a lunar mystery waiting to be solved. Close to the top, at number two, we find the Hellas Planitia on Mars. This vast, extraordinary impact basin is one of the largest in our solar system, and it certainly doesn't shy away from flaunting its impressive size. Spanning a whopping 4,300 miles in diameter, Hellas Planitia is so expansive that it covers nearly half of the southern hemisphere of Mars. Discovered in the late 19th century by an Italian astronomer named Giovanni Schiaparelli, its name, Hellas, is derived from the classical Greek name for Greece. It's a tip of the hat to the astronomer's homeland and a testament to the global fascination with the cosmos. So what makes Hellas Planitia so unique and intriguing? Well, this mammoth basin is a treasure trove of scientific intrigue. Its depth reaches about five miles below the average surface level on Mars. Interestingly, this makes the base of the basin one of the lowest points in the solar system. Furthermore, the basin's floor often hosts a layer of frost during the Martian winter, a sight that's as beautiful as it is mystifying. Hellas Planitia is also a hotbed for Mars quakes, seismic activities similar to earthquakes, which supports the theory that Mars is not a geologically dead planet. All these unique aspects make Hellas Planitia more than just a crater. It's a window into the history and possible future of Mars, a Martian mystery that continues to intrigue. At the top of our list, at number one, we have the infamous Chicxulub Crater, right here on Earth. Nestled near the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico, the Chicxulub Crater is an intriguing testament to Earth's volatile past. It's not just a hole in the ground, but a mind-boggling 150 kilometers wide scar, the result of a catastrophic asteroid impact. Discovered in the late 1970s by geophysicists looking for petroleum, this impact site was initially a mystery. It remained hidden for decades, buried under several kilometers of sediment, but it wasn't long before scientists connected the dots. The Chicxulub crater is believed to be the epicenter of the event that led to the extinction of nearly 75% of all species on Earth around 66 million years ago. This includes the non-avian dinosaurs, those colossal creatures that once dominated our planet. The asteroid that caused this crater was about 10 to 15 kilometers wide, 
and its impact released energy equivalent to billions of atomic bombs. The aftermath? A nuclear winter scenario with dust and debris blocking sunlight leading to a drastic climate shift. This event reshaped life on Earth, paving the way for mammals and eventually us human beings to thrive. The Chicxulub crater is thus not just a geographical feature, but a pivotal point in the story of life on our planet. The Chicxulub crater, a stark reminder of our planet's turbulent past. From Mars to Mercury, from our moon to the moons of Jupiter and Saturn, we have traveled across the solar system, exploring its most enigmatic craters. We've delved into the mysteries of Huygens on Mars with its curious central peak, and Caloris on Mercury, a scar left by the solar system's violent past. We've scrutinized Stickney on Phobos, the largest crater relative to the size of its celestial body, and Tycho on the Moon, a relatively young feature with a fascinatingly complex ray system. We've marveled at Herschel on Mimas, a crater that makes the Moon look like the Death Star, and Rhea Silvia on Vesta home to one of the tallest mountains in the solar system. We've admired Valhalla on Callisto, a multi-ring wonder, and the South Pole Aitken Basin on the Moon, the largest, deepest, and oldest basin. We've pondered Hellas Planitia on Mars, a depression that could swallow Mount Everest, and Chicxulub on Earth, the dinosaur killer. These craters etched in the fabric of our solar system continue to captivate us, reminding us of the ever-present mysteries of the universe waiting to be unraveled. And as our cosmic journey draws to a close, we hope you've learned something new about the fascinating craters and celestial bodies that dot our solar system. If you enjoyed this journey and found it informative, please give a like to this video. Your likes and comments are a testament to the wonders of our universe and the thirst for knowledge that we all share. Don't forget to share your thoughts, opinions and any questions you might have in the comments section. We'd love to hear what you think about these celestial wonders and their mysteries. And of course, if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. This will ensure you don't miss out on any of our future journeys through the cosmos. Lastly, if you think your friends and family would enjoy this cosmic journey as much as you did, don't hesitate to share this video with them. After all, the mysteries of the universe are best explored together. Until our next journey, keep gazing at the stars and wondering about the mysteries they hold. Goodbye and keep exploring.